I'd been in the clothing industry all my life and I'd had positions, I was head of design and I had a lot of responsibilities and all of a sudden I felt that I wasn't that person anymore. I was worried that I was going to lose my job. Now, no one had specifically said that to me. It was just something always at the back of my mind that my condition was going to make me lose my job. But then, in the end, I, I got to the stage where I had to say something. I am really happy that Nina did bring it to my attention that she is living with MS. Um, it then gave me the opportunity to be able to work with her and support her to make sure that she was fulfilling her role. It was a huge relief and I've had a lot of support from my colleagues. After chatting with Nina, um, I did really encourage her to reach out to MS and to see what um, support was available. When Stephanie sort of mentioned it and whatever, I thought, oh, okay, well, that was my opportunity to, to approach them and see what it was all about. So from this, we were then introduced to Marley from the Employment Support Service. I met with Nina and her partner to identify how are the symptoms of MS affecting Nina at her workplace. So we started prioritising what kind of support and assistance the MS Employment Support Service will assist Nina with and her employer as well so she can continue working and manage better her symptoms and at work. Marley's always, she's always there. She's always either checking on me to see if things are all right or she's been a friend to both my partner and I and she's helped us find out about a lot of things that were out there to be had, but I had no idea. It was a great opportunity for us to get an understanding of what support we needed to give Nina. Marley organised a roller mouse, which means I didn't have to use my uh, right hand. She's encouraged me to get onto a dragon. You wear the headphones, and I can just speak into the microphone and the computer does the writing for me. Stephanie, my manager, is also, along with Marley, organising to have a workstation at home. The first thing I did was encouraging Nina to use her single point stick so she can walk more safely by compensating for her reduced balance issues. I've also organised equipment for her to be able to measure garments more efficiently and easily, even though she is um, experiencing weakness in her right hand. If it wasn't for the Employment Support Service, we wouldn't have been able to support Nina in the way that we have. I'm so glad that I was encouraged to contact the Employment Support Service. I feel that my work has improved, that I'd gone back to a level that I thought was really me.